Heads, what's up? It's Mateo from MyQuitSmoking.com. Last week I had a table that comes into my restaurant periodically and they know the owners and they come up, I work in a tiki bar upstairs and it's an outside bar and they come up, there's three of them and I call them the chain smokers because you know what they do? They chain smoke the entire time they are there and it's just sickening to me like I understand if you're a smoker and you want to go out to an outside restaurant and you want to have a cigarette before you eat have a cigarette after you eat and just chill and relax I get that I understand that I respect that I don't judge that but this is what happens with them as soon as they sat down the packs of cigarettes came came out and before the menus were even placed in front of them the ashtray was like right at the center of the table and they're lighting up like like and they smoked the entire time they smoked through their meal you know while they were eating they went through a whole pack of cigarettes because the pack of cigarettes after they left was empty that I threw away and the worst part about it is that they totally disregard the fact that there was a family sitting right next to them with a baby and multiple kids just sitting two feet away from them. Now I understand if you like smoke one cigarette or something but these people were just chain smoking and chain smoking and chain smoking while they were eating the entire time and it's just it's just disrespectful I mean who do you think you are really I mean yeah smokers have rights we all have rights but have a little bit of class sure you can smoke but you can also get off your butt and walk 10 feet over there where you're not in front of children the whole time that's what I'm getting at I mean if you want to smoke fine but you don't have to literally smoke two feet away from a baby I mean come on that whole family's eating they're on vacation they're trying to have a good time and you're you're just chain smoking in front of them it bothers them it bothers people who are eating it bothers people who are trying to have a good time you if you're if you choose to chain smoke the entire time get up off your butt and walk towards the bar or walk where there's no one sitting because you're just being super annoying it's disrespectful and I'm gonna say something sooner or later because I really don't care I don't care if you're the owner I don't care if you know the owner I don't care how much money you have I don't care who you know the fact is you're disrespectful and you need some class in your life. I'm just totally over it. I'm totally over it. I even had a table once, not these people, but um, way back when, I had a table once that said, oh, we got here first. Oh, we got here first. So that gives you every right to disrespect everyone around you and just annoy everyone around you just because you got there first and the, center, the, the universe is centered around you apparently. Have a little bit of respect for the people around you and respect for yourself. I'm just sick of it. I'm just sick of being around smokers who don't really care about their personal health. I mean, and this was a group of people where the grandmother was just chained like cigarette after cigarette after cigarette. And she was with her grandson and he was chain smoking and he, he was buying beer so he had to have been no older than 21 or 22, maybe 23, but I mean, to me, he was an absolute pack a day smoker already at that age and his role models were chain smokers themselves. So he's got a rough life ahead of him, ahead of him for sure. He's got a rough life ahead of him. So if you smoke cigarettes, that's fine. I'm not judging that. If you're at a restaurant where you can smoke, like here in Florida, if it's an outside restaurant and you are allowed to smoke, that's fine. I get it. I'm not going to judge that and I won't look down on you. But if there's literally a family two feet away from you and there's a baby in a carrier, you know, a newborn baby and you're chain smoking your, your Paul Malls, you know, have a little bit of class, have a little bit of respect for everyone around you and just get up and walk to literally 10 feet. You walked up the stairs to the tiki bar, you weren't carried, you walked, you got up to the tiki bar, you can walk 10 feet over there and, and smoke your cigarette. And if you see children, especially if you see children, get up, 
walk a few feet away where there aren't children more towards the bar where there's other people smoking and that's that just you don't have to dis you know disrupt everyone's meal have everyone turn around and look at you and think what the hell are they doing you know just be a, a respectable human being that's all I ask that's all I ask and I don't like kids you know like I'm not a kid person to begin with but I'm not a monster I would never just you know if I saw if even if it was a complete stranger if I saw a baby like right there right there I wouldn't be smoking in front of it I would obviously I'm not gonna just allow the baby to be engulfed with the smoke that I'm exhaling that's all so that's my little rant for today um, I'm gonna enjoy this sunset it's pretty cool and I'll see you next week